Welcome back, everybody, to the triple threat of Kasumi, Akechi, and Joker. I'm your host, the Musical Gamer. Welcome back to some P5R. We have made it to the strange, mysterious palace that we actually uh, saw Kasumi get sucked into that one time and woke to our persona here. We're sort of exploring it. Things are weird on the outside. Things that shouldn't exist exist, and people don't recognize or remember anything. Oh, shit. You were misguided. Uh, what? What do you mean? Do not search for pain. Only tragedy awaits you beyond here. Huh. A newcomer. All these warnings of pain and tragedy. Who is your ruler? Why do you all think you know so much about me? Oh, jeez. If you won't give me an answer, then I'll just force my way through. Oh, shit. All right, she's angry now, too. Uh, Belial's holy crap. You okay there, Kasumi? Oh dear. Nothing she's doing is working. Stop rushing into things. Just calm down. Oh, I'm sorry. This is it. Time your attacks with mine. Uh, right. All right, here we go. Uh, do they do actually? Here. Oh. They're resistant to physical attacks. <laughs> That's funny. We actually know the fact that they're resistant to physical here. attacks. Thanks for the. Uh, <laughs> thanks for the. Thanks for the help there, Cosmic. Uh, you took you took care of one of their weaknesses for us. Oh, holy crap! Yeah, that did plenty of damage. Now hit them. Um. Excuse me. Oh wait, shit. I derped. I derped. Yeah, good dodge. Holy shit. Ah, uh, you're. Hmm. Let me just shoot you. Holy crap! You're a you're a wiry little bastard, ain't you? The only thing you got going for you is the fact that you can uh you can you can you can use your bless skills and they still dodge. Okay, they're they're defeated, but we didn't kill them. Are we gonna question them? Such a fool, rejecting our Lord's mercy. In that case, witness it for yourself. What? What do you mean? Now what? Um... Your performance exceeded anything seen before in the junior class. It was absolutely stunning. But you'll be entering high school soon. Will that impact your career in gymnastics? Oh, I have no intentions of stopping. It's my dream to compete and win at the international level. How wonderful. One last question. Is there anyone you'd like to give a shout out while you have the chance? My younger sister. She should be here in the stadium. What? Wait, what? Oh, there she is! Sumire! We... Excuse me? <laughs> Sumire! I did it! What? Both of us have the same dream, to be international champions. Stop. Let's make it come true, Sumire! Together! You mean you're wait Yoshizawa son? You're you What? I really hope this helped you understand. Wait what? A man's voice. If you keep pushing on like this, you're going to find nothing but heartache. Wait a fucking minute. Please. Won't you stop fighting this and just return to the current reality? Wait a wait a fucking whoa 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 that voice. Nothing but heartache, huh? I don't understand what you're saying, but I have no intention of leaving now. We are in agreement there. 
We also refuse to do as you say. Now why don't you drop the big voice behind the curtain act and face us directly? As you wish. What? But... Head on down. I'll meet you there. He agreed to that much more readily than I expected. Perhaps the palace's ruler really will make his appearance. Kasumi, are you okay? Or... Thanks for your concern. Should I call you... But I'm fine. Really. Let's go. You sure about that? <laughs> and of course, Akechi has it all Kasumi figured out. Kasumi Yoshizawa, eh? Oh, no. No, you're not saying... Oh, no, game. Game, what have you... Game, what have you done? Game, what have you... What have you done? Oh... Guys, I, I'm 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 getting like this, really really bad, bad feeling, all up my all up my chest, all up my back, everything everything is feeling wrong. That voice, Kasumi. Is he this palace's? Oh no! It's been quite a while, hasn't it? Oh no! No. Maruki. Oh no. 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 I had a feeling, but no. Glad to see you're all doing well. All that talk about research and getting rid of pain. Oh. Balls. I pretty much figured that you would end up infiltrating this place. Truth be told, this isn't how I was hoping we would meet again. Dr. Maruki. You're the ruler of this palace? Palace? A place where distorted desires manifest. We're asking if you're the source of the desires here. Ah, I see. Well, to use your own words, yes, I am this palace's ruler. But in my case, it seems a tad different from the ones you've seen. Would we also be correct in believing that you're involved in the abnormalities outside the palace as well? Yes, you would. Do you like the reality I created for you? Created a real? What have you done? You created it? You made this? Hold on a second, that's like the power of Yaldabaoth right there. Are you trying to tell me that you've discovered the power of the gods here? That's right. I have gained the power to alter reality to make it whatever the people wish for. What? How the... That can't be! People don't have that kind of power. I understand how this could be hard to grasp. At any rate, our cruel and unforgiving reality is going to change. And that includes Yoshizawa-san's awful past, too. My... past? Dr. Maruki? What do you mean? What's happened to me? All right. I had honestly hoped that all those warnings you were given would change your minds. But if it's your true desire, then I want you to recall who you really are. And I want you two to learn as well. Oh no. Once you have, you'll need to choose between the two realities. The merciless one, or the one I've formed. What? Wait, no, I don't want showtime. What is this? Three, two, one. That's... Today was brutal, huh? Oh. Feeling okay? It's not that. <sighs> Why am I doing so bad? I keep messing up my routine. Your growth spurts just changed your eye level. You'll get used to it. Look, you're as tall as I am now. <laughs> we practice the same amount. Uh, but you are the one who always gets first place. I can't catch up to you, Kasumi. You know why? Because it's my right as the elder sister. We're in the same grade, though. Oh, don't be so down. We'll reach the top of the world together. That's our dream, right? You don't get it, huh? You'll never understand how I feel. What? 
Kasumi. If I were like you, things would be so much better. Hey! Wait up! Kasumi's the one that people want. Look where you're going! The light's red! Hey! The talented one who can reach the top of the world. Sumire, stop! Listen to me! Sumire! No. Wait a minute, but... But then... Uh, seems you remembered. That's right. I'm... Kasumi? No. Kasumi? No. That's not right. I'm... I'm not Kasumi. The girl named Kasumi Yoshizawa is currently deceased. It was last spring. Before I started at Shujin, we were walking home from practice. It happened right there, on that street in the video. You know what? We heard about it too. On that radio. The day we came to Shujin the first time with Coffee Dad, they said a horrible accident took place. In fact, we already connected that dot, but... But... I wasn't looking where I was going. And Kasumi... She protected me from the car. I was saved by Kasumi. I robbed her of her dreams. And even her life. I'm... Her younger sister. Sumira Yoshizawa. I'll take over from here. You've been living as your sister? This whole time, or is there something I'm missing here? I do play a part in this story. Wait, what? You do? Her real name is Sumire Yoshizawa. She's Kasumi-san's younger sister, but for months now, she's only seen herself as being Kasumi Yoshizawa, her deceased elder sister. Wait, wait, what? She's seen herself? Of course, it was only her cognition of herself that changed. So to the people around her, she was still Sumire-san. For some reason, though, there were a few rare exceptions to this. Did something happen to make you believe she was Kasumi-san? Seems to be a Shujin Academy pocketbook. The name Kasumi Yoshida... Wait. Wait. You... You've got to be kidding me. It appears you were clueless. But she was Sumire Yoshizawa from the start. You have got to be kidding me! That's right! Looking back on it now, only we were the ones who called her by her first name! Only us! Everyone else called her Yoshizawa-san! Do you mean to tell me that... I was the one who got this wrong? That me and her were the only people who thought she was Kasumi and everybody else knew she was Sumire? However, when we watched that other video, she gave her name as Kasumi Yoshizawa. Considering such an odd claim, I'd actually suspected for a moment that she was the palace ruler. It's fair. Hon honestly, I had the thought too when we came in here the first time. After Kasumi died, but before I started at Shujin, I received counseling from Dr. Maruki. That was when I told him. If Kasumi is gone, and can't make her dream come true, 
Then I want to become Kasumi, so I can turn her dream into reality for her. So that's why you meddled with her cognition? For her own wishes? You warped her cognition? That's right. How is that even possible? Limited as it was, I already had the power at the time to actualize her wish. How powerful were you this whole time? Oh god, we just made him even stronger, didn't we? Put yourselves in her shoes for a moment. Sumire-san's older sister died from protecting her. Imagine surviving such a dismal tragedy. Who would be able to cope with that survivor's guilt, let alone heal from the emotional scarring that she suffered? If Sumire-san can live a healthy, positive life by becoming Kasumi-san, then I believe that reality is what would make her happy. That's bullshit! How can you be happy being not you? I've had enough of your high and mighty rationalization. Yeah, me too! All you really did was use her to try and make everyone acknowledge the validity of your research. Yeah, we can't forget about that either. So that's how you see things, huh? That's quite unfortunate. Of course I wanted society to acknowledge cognitive science through my research. But that's because my goal is to save everyone in the world like Yoshizawa-san by ending all suffering. You, by making people forget who they truly are? By <laughs> basically having people run away from their problems. This doesn't solve anything. It just... It masks it. It hides it. But it doesn't change anything. My work will convert the wishes of the people into reality. Even as we speak, my research is coming to fruition. No one will ever have to suffer again under the yoke of an unfair world. This... palace, you called it? It's a place where its ruler's desires take physical form, yes? I wish to utilize my research to save humanity. I suppose that would be the desire I hold dearest. What total nonsense. You could very well be right. Still, I'm entirely serious about changing our imperfect reality. Just as she was saved by becoming Kasumi, I'll save every other person in the world currently suffering. In fact, it's my responsibility to do so. You can see how this world's bestowed the duty upon me. Bestowed the duty? More like you just decided this for yourself. What happens to the old reality, then? I don't know for certain. It'll most likely be treated as if it never existed. The cruel reality will cease to be, and the reality I generate will be the sole world recognized by society. And you assume we'll buy into your brainwashing and just live in the palm of your hand. Honestly, that sounds absolutely revolting. Yeah, I'm with Akechi, and when I'm with Akechi, you know you done fucked up. All right, so that's your answer, Akechi-kun. How about the others? Yoshizawa-san, allow me to ask you yet again. Which reality is it that you wish to inhabit? Huh? If you so desire, you can return to your life as Sumire. But if you'd rather continue your life as Kasumi, I can grant that wish for you as well. Dr. Maruki... I... Come on, don't be manipulated like this. You gotta believe. Be you. It's impossible. What? I'm sorry, senpai. I... I can't go back to being her. Why? I can't be the one who led her sister to her death. Please don't judge her. This is just evidence of how painful life is for her. Life comes with pain. You can't have life without pain. If you choose to get rid of it all, then why live? You two sense doubts forming in the reality I manifested. That's what brought you here. But please, remember this as well. You two aren't excluded from the people that I wish to save. The hell is that supposed to mean? Come now. Won't you accept my reality for your own happiness? Hell no! I'll find my own goddamn happiness! No deal so far, huh? You taught me so much. What have you become? Whoa, whoa! Oh god, I've seen enough hentai to know where this is going! 
What do you think you're doing with her? I won't harm her. It's in her best interest that you turn back. You've made clear that you reject the reality she desires. The reality where she lives as Kasumi Yoshizawa. <sighs> this isn't reality. It saddens me when you speak that way. Don't you understand? You deny her wishes when you say such things. Her wishes, huh? This isn't just for her. I'm doing all of this for yourselves as well. I honestly do want to come to terms with you. We should talk. Think about it. You both have dreams, no? I have the power to make them come true. My reality can become just the way you like. Total waste of my time. A shame, but I understand. Well then, we just have to resort to force now, don't we? Violence is not my thing. <laughs> what? What do you get? Oh, you're just gonna leave it to your your lackeys, huh? Whoa, what the hell? Whoa, what is he doing? Whoa! Whoa! What is that? It seems we're out of options here. Holy shit! <laughs> Time to fight. Are you ready? Born ready. Keep up and don't embarrass me. <laughs> I could say the same to you. Gonna use your left hand this time. What the hell is this Cthulhu thing? Stop it, imbeciles. Rejecting our lord. Disgusting. We're not here to listen to your bullshit. Yeah, you tell that asshole. Oh, you're an almighty me, huh? That's gonna go so well. So this what is the? the Akechi! Oh, you talk big for somebody who just got chicken. God damn it. What the hell? All right, where the, where where's the things that get rid of get rid of fear? Where's the things that get rid of fear? Hold on. Uh, cures fear for one ally. Perfect. Good. Let's Don't go. be afeared. Eat your donut and shut up. Uh, do we want to? You know what? Fuck it. Fuck you. I'm gonna nuke you. Nuke you with the power of a cosmic flare. I knew you wouldn't like that. I take even less damage now. Oh, great. Now I'm a fear. All right, I take that back. Hey! <laughs> Your own abilities come to bite you in the ass there, Doc. Oh, man. How about curse? Does curse work here? Nope, you block curse. What are you? This. That is, uh... Hmm. That is kind of terrifying. That missed. Lovely. Don't know having your HP. Wow, you are really good at inflicting fear, huh? Someone heal me. Hmm. Uh, looks like I'm going to need to uh, maybe use one of these things. Use this. There we go. That'll patch you up for the time being. You're just gonna have to sit there, man, with your with your low HP. You're gonna have to just deal with it because uh, I'm gonna need to do something about this guy myself. <laughs> All right, let's try myriad yeah. slashes. Can we hit him? There we go. That's better. That's better. He's at half HP now. He's not that tough. Just the fear is a little bit of a problem. Uh oh. That's not necessarily good. Hmm. Do we have those, uh, magic- yeah, magic ointments. Hmm. Yeah, go ahead. Let's throw these up, please. Okay. I don't trust whatever the hell this thing's about to do. Vacuum wave! Hey, there we go! Ooh, you blocked that, huh? Was that a wind attack? 
like, you've got to be kidding me. You're going to do it again, huh? These guys are powerful and immune to curse attacks. Hmm. I'll break them. See, I have a bad feeling. Yeah, me going on the offense here is uh, not going to end well. All right, then Adavaka. Or, uh, oh, you know what, actually? Koryu. All right. You're even better. We're gonna need to just be a little careful here. I'm gonna do this again. This is gonna hit this time. How much damage? Ah, it's quite a bit. You've gotta be joking. Again? Really? You're just gonna have me keep, uh, keep having to heal you, huh? Alright, fine. I'll catch you. You deal the damage. Oh, that is a lot of damage. You deal the damage, I'll keep us topped off. Nice time. Ow. Oh, you. Yeah. Okay. You're gonna do that, huh? Alright, just a little bit more. Psycho Force. Oh, of course that would heal him! I'm an idiot! This is the guy who controls cognition! Of course that would fucking heal him! God damn it! Oh, I'm a moron! I'm an absolute idiot! Why didn't I think about that? Oh, it makes so much sense! Damn it! Alright, Koryu, you, you're not gonna be that useful. Sorry, dude. I thought you'd be better. Oh, no. Okay, then. Uh, who... Who here has an ability they still need to learn? Adavaka actually still has an ability he needs to learn. This is fine. Give physical damage to all foes. Yeah, let's um, let's not do that. Let's hmm. let's just heal, because I don't think we're killing him this turn. <laughs> Holy crap! This is going a little annoyingly, mostly because we only have two people. Ha! You hit yourself, buddy. You're shaking though. That's less than good. Uh, can I take you out? No, not quite. Oh, wait, maybe? What is this? You're right. You motherfucker. Are you kidding me right now? Whoa! Did you just quit running your mouth already? I'm going to shut that thing up. Give me a hand! Move! Wait, what? Wait, whoa. Whoa, excuse me? Wait, wait a fucking minute. Wait, what is this? Showtime? No more games. Between us? I want to see that all the time now. Continue this. I'm fairly certain any further negotiating is pointless. That seems to be the case, unfortunately. But first, I have an idea. Oh, do you now? Rather than explain it with words, I'd like you to actually see this new reality with your own eyes. I know that your friends are already enjoying it. Wait, what? Oh, you son of a- of course they are! Hand her over! That I cannot do. As I said before, she wishes to live in the reality where she is Kasumi. There's no way I can hand her over to you with matters as they currently are. I already told you that I won't harm her, and I'll swear by it. Don't worry about her. Go. Look at the reality I've created for you all. Once you've seen the results, I know you'll realize which future is best. You think we'll just obey your orders? I apologize, but you really are going through with this, even if it's by force. 
I thought you said you don't like violence. Whoa. Wait, what? Oh, no. We'll meet again one week from today, January 9th. I genuinely pray that you'll change your mind by then. He got away. We shouldn't chase him too far. Let's say we head back for now. Sure. God. <laughs> Wibbly wobbly psychedelic groovy that 70s show bullshit. I had spent all that time investigating the people around you so I could set you up. To think Takuto Maruki of all people would be the mastermind behind this absurd situation. <laughs> yeah, caught you off guard too, huh? And he happens to be warping the very fabric of reality while ranting about making everyone's dreams come true. Talk about incomprehensible motives. I can't even wrap my head around such intentions. Honestly, I might actually have an idea. At any rate, we need to figure out our next steps. Oh god, I'm worried about Sumire. It's Sumire. I think it'd be suicide to march back in there at the moment. We need intel first. If we're going to stand up to him, we have to know more than nothing. I'll do some investigating on my own. All right, then. I hate that we have to do what he says, but Maruki told us we have to wait until January 9th. Let's meet up here next week. Although, I imagine both our lives will be very different if you choose to live in this reality as your friends have been. I'll see you next time, Akechi. So this is the reality that Maruki created. I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. There's no point in obsessing over it. Let's just go home. God, what is going on? This is... This is not what I thought would happen. Oi. Ah. Uh, hey there. Morgana? Ring a ding ding. Hello? Akechi. It's me. I discovered something that I thought I should tell you right away. Called Yoshizawa-san's house to see what I'd learn. They believe she's been at training camp since yesterday. To think. Maruki really is changing our physical reality as he sees fit. That is honestly scary. No kidding. This is the first time I've witnessed a power that even comes close to this magnitude. Even the great phantom thieves you're so proud of fell in line with this scheme. You're going to see if you can change their minds, aren't you? Well, fine. I suppose we can use the manpower. If you can actually bring them to their senses, that is. That's wholly dependent on whether or not they're capable of leaving the reality they supposedly wished for. That might be hard. God, I'm just thinking about Futaba. I'll focus on investigating Maruki further. You do what you need to. Alright, thanks. Remember what we agreed upon before? We made a deal here. Well, I'll reach out to you should anything come up. Good night. Was that a catchy? You two seem to be getting along well lately. Hey, so I was thinking, why don't us phantom thieves all go to a hot spring together sometime? And Lady Anne and I can... <laughs> How's that sound? Perfect, right? We should ask the rest of the gang soon. Oh, God. It seems this reality is the one that Morgana wished for. That he was human. Alright, we ought to hit the hate for today. The bed may be a tad too cozy for the both of us. Oh, I'll just start sleeping on the sofa instead. Are you happy? Where's this coming from? Well, yeah, I'd say I'm happy. Do you like this reality? Like reality? Well, it is the one we fought for with everyone else, so... Wait, what did I mean by... That doesn't seem right. I got captured in Kamashita's palace, and that's when I met you guys. When we'd go to Mementos, I'd transform into a... Come on, keep thinking it through, man. Please. Please, keep thinking. Got to be useful for humans that I admired so much. Nothing could make me happier. What was... Sorry, I'm gonna go out and do some thinking for a bit. You should get some sleep. Morgana... Come on, please. Seems all I can do now is wait. Would we like to save our current progress? Yes, we would, and when we come back with some more P5R, revelations. Many, many revelations. Holy, holy crap. 
is the Musical Gamer signing off. I'll see you guys in the next video. Catch you guys then.